Holy Smokes, a tough act to follow. Thank you all very much for your time. Um, people ask me after 17 years in the legislature, what was the toughest thing you've ever done? And I have to tell you, it was last session, 2007, and bringing Oregon uh, to uh, the first major change in our ethics laws since the Watergate era. And why was this so difficult? It was difficult because my colleagues, frankly, on both sides of the aisle, didn't want to change our ethics laws. And it was difficult because the lobby didn't want to change the way our ethics laws were. But I did it, and I worked with Diane Rosenbaum to get it done because we knew it was the right thing to do. When I came to the Senate, John Marks, you know this, there were 10 Democrats. I had the vision, I had the patience, I had the passion, and I had the persistence to work for eight years to change the makeup of the state Senate. I will tell you that I truly believe it, it will take patience, passion, and persistence to fight to put integrity back into Oregon's initiative system, to bring uh, Oregon to fiscal reform through using our audits division, and lastly, to work collaboratively on the state lands board to maximize revenue for our schools while preserving the environment. I have the support of a number of folks in the state, um, pretty key organizations for me, ones I've worked with over the years. You might want to call them special interests. I think they're just special. The Oregon League of Conservation Voters, NARAL Pro-Choice Oregon, I've worked with them for over 15 years to bring contraceptive equity to this state. Uh, Basic Rights Oregon, I worked with that organization for 16 years to provide civil rights for all of Oregon. And lastly, the Oregon Education Association, teachers and educators around the state. It would mean a great deal to me to have your support, and hopefully I can do it and win by more than seven votes. Thank you very much.